vertical line method to examine the functions of the type y equals to fx. In this, whenever we are given a curve, we will draw vertical lines. And if one vertical line cuts the curve at two points, it means one x component is giving rise to two y components. So that curve will not be a function. So we have different curves here. I'm taking you to the first curve. Here, when we keep on plotting the vertical lines, one can observe that all the lines are cutting the curve at only one point. So this curve is a function of the type y equals to fx. We exercise another curve now and just see. One vertical line is sufficient because this vertical line is cutting the curve at two points. That is, corresponding to one x component, there are two y components which is against the definition of the curve, of the function. So this curve is not a function of the type y equals to fx. Coming on to third, or you can enjoy by plotting the vertical lines because all the vertical lines are cutting the curve at one point only. That is, each is cutting the line. Each is cutting the curve at only one point. So this is also a function of the type y equals to fx. The fourth one. I draw this vertical line and you can see that it is cutting the curve at three points. So this is not a function of the type y equals to fx. So I believe now you understand the concept of vertical line method. Thank you very much and good luck.